G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another let's play let's go let's see let's do and today what the hell are we going to do? Star Citizen folks and yes I'm lying dead at Everest Harbour because nothing's bloody working it's going crazy at the moment I hope you guys are having a much better gameplay so, as I mentioned in my last video, I'm going to have to pull something out of the archive, and um, yeah, so this was never to be seen, never to be shown, but because I have not been able to do anything besides copying 30k errors for the whole weekend, well, we got to have something, eh, folks? So, again, we're not worried about this one too much. So, what, what, were I, what was I doing with this? Well, actually, I wanted to go off. I've got my good old C2 still, so it's not too far in the distant paths. But what I want to do is go off and actually see if I can get some cargo out of those salvage um, missions. And it was a good boy salvage mission. At least, that's what I thought I picked. Um, but yeah, so I'm coming up a bit close. I've done a scan and it revealed fuck all, as you can see. There is absolutely, it says nothing in here with respect to cargo or anything along those lines. But I know that there's something in there. It is a Mercury Star Runner, so it has to have something in there. Even if it's food, it's got to be something in there. So what I'm doing now is kind of lining myself up. It's not going to be the best lineup, but it's going to... Yeah, can I get a bit closer? Yeah. There we go. So, I won't go too close. I think that should be enough now, Ev. Can stop this. Beautiful. So, oh, okay, great. Yep. We've been told to leave the area. Yeah, 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 yeah. Usual shit. So, I'm going to jump out of the um, pilot seat. I'm going to turn the engines off so I don't smack anything and then the ship just decides to rotate away. And, um, yeah, we're going to go down. If the door fucking opens. Unbelievable. You can't see this, but I'm shaking my head. But, yeah, we're going to go down and we're going to open up the front. And um, we're going to just, well, I don't want to call it space walkover. This thing drives me nuts. So if you hold down, well, for the moment in this patch anyway, shift key, you should be able to slide down the stairs. The problem is you get stuck on the fucking things. You go up and down like a bloody yo-yo. Okay, so let's open these things up. I've never actually seen them open up this way before. Well, that's quite cool. Now, we'll just head on over. While the ramp is still making its way that way. There you go. So we'll just go over. There's got to be something worth stealing from here. Although I could be um, really unlucky and just have pretty much nothing in there, but I don't think so. There's got to be something. All right. So what have we got here, folks? Well, we've got something in there. Whoa. Okay. What do you reckon? I think that might be a bit too far away. I think I have to line up the ship. Okay, so even if I gather like, I don't know, a couple SCU of processed foods, that's okay. It's all about the training folks, because as we all know, in 3.23.x, which is probably somewhere after, um, we're gonna be doing all this shit manually. So I better get used to doing this shit manually. So here we go. That's not too bad. Come on, doors, open up. You know what I'm really looking forward to in this next patch, if they've done it or not? If the doors just remain open. That's all I want. If I'm the only one in the ship, I just want everything to stay open. If somebody else comes in, then yeah, lock it down. Okay, so. And also the computer voice in this is a bit annoying at times. Okay, so let's go a bit closer. We're going to be fine-tuning the fuckery here, folks. So how does that look? Kind of okay. I don't want to smash into the ship, because that would just be stupid. Okay. Now, I want to lower mine a little bit further down. Okay, I'm moving across there. Oh, am I going to kiss it or not? What do you reckon? Yeah, I think that's a winner. Okay. So we'll get out of the chair. Yeah, here we go. Running straight into the door. Which doesn't want to open. For fuck's sake. OK, 
Come on. You, you got to honestly ask yourselves. If you're running through the first one and you're approaching the second one, what is the third door waiting for? <laughs> anyway, here we go down. Nice. And he goes back up, down. And up, fuck, I hate this. Just get the fuck off the elevator. Escalator, stairs, whatever the fuck it is, ladder. Shit. No, oh, I've lost it, folks. It's very early in the morning when I'm doing this, and I should be doing this later in the day. But I was hoping to get a little bit of Star Citizen in, maybe something that I could use. Oh, no, that's a bit big. And there was nothing. So, yeah, everybody in CIG must be getting ready for the next patch. All hands on deck in that sense, which is fine. So, I was not even paying attention to what the hell I just pulled over there. Why is this stupid gun doing this now? Processed food. All right. Oh, fucking hell, this gun. There you go. Stay. No, no, don't go down. Just stay up so I can see. Yeah, okay, fuck it. I'll do it like this. You know what? Screw it. It's not the best way, but at least it works. So we'll put this one a little bit over here. And we'll grab the next one. Maybe not that one. Why isn't that fucking working? Oh no, that's because it's the big one. I don't want the big one, I want the small ones in front of it. So process food again. Put this one up on top. What happened to snap the grid? Oh, that sucks. All right, this next one. No, not the big one. The one in front of it. There you go. Ah, distilled spirits. Very nice. No, don't don't get stuck there. Come on. No, now the bloody grid wants to show up. And next one. Process foods again. Again, we'll throw him down the back. About there. And now let's get this big boy out. Oh, okay. Not too bad. Come on, we'll put you down over here. Well, yep, you snapped in the grid. What's this one? Oh, I did <laughs> distilled spirits again. Now, normally I would actually leave this thing out of the video because it's mindlessly boring. And I understand that. What's this one? Processed foods. Fuck, it's huge. I didn't expect that, but um, yeah, again, folks, we are literally pretty much hitting the bottom of the barrel when it comes to content for this thing at the moment, at least workable content. If everybody wants to see um, a 30 minute YouTube video of me getting 30k errors all the time, um, yeah, sure, but that'd be fucking boring. At least it was painful for everybody that was doing it, and we jumped to so many servers, folks, you would not believe we hit the US servers, we hit the Asian servers, we hit the European servers, and it was just pretty much the same shit. It was unbelievably painful. We thought we were doing okay on one of the servers where we actually um, didn't have anybody like um, have a 30k for at least 40 minutes. Everybody was jumping up and down, and then as soon as more people started coming on, yeah, it just crapped itself. Why is it going pew pew? Yeah, okay, snap the grid. All right. So I don't see anything else there, but let's have a quick jump in. Maybe there's something on the side. No. Nah. All right, I'm not even going to bugger eyes around with this. So, yeah. There we have it, folks. So we've got some items in here. Some interesting ones as well. I didn't mention it on purpose. But if you read it, you would have seen it. Let's holster this bloody thing. Whoa. My shields are being hit. Hang on. Some ones that come to found me. Come on, don't, don't sit there and take 10 hours. All right, good. 
That's what you need when you're under attack. How the doors take 40 minutes to fucking open. And into the pilot seat. Something's firing at me for sure, and I thought this was just something down. Yeah, okay. Where is he? Can you guys see him? I see the marker down there, but... Are uh, you on? Let's have a look. What are ya? Really? I love the NPC cup. Why would I want to do that? And anyway, why did you come shooting at me if I was going to do that? There we go. Oh, he took damage. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. Do I want to make him go boom? You bet I do. There you go. Take that. Pissing me off before. Alright, so we've got everything out of this one. Let's make it go boom as well. Alright, she's disabled. And she's fucked. All right, I like that. So we'll make our way to area 18. Can't have, you can't destroy it any more than this. Don't take out the frustration on it. Would, you, would love to see this break into smithereens. It ain't gonna fucking work, is it? If only this ship had a missile, I could fire at it. Should I try to take out the nacelle? Nah. Alright, fuck it. So, Area 18. So, folks, if you saw my last video, then you're going to know exactly what's going to happen here. And this was where it all happened. So, I came to Area 18, feeling good about myself, realizing that I can actually sell my um, cargo on Weller at that, I don't know, Samson Delilah thing, whatever the hell it's fucking called. Um, butcher's Backyard, who the hell knows. But, yeah... It, didn't happen so I was pressing B on the keyboard as of 3.22 patch and um, yeah bugger all happened so yeah we're, we're not having a good day here so I turned the thing off again turned it on you know the IT for um, for Star Citizen just turn the fucking thing off and on again she'd be right let the damn thing calculate brought it over let the damn thing calibrate And then press B again, and nothing fucking happened. So this means that it's absolutely buggered. So I cleared the roots, thinking, all right, fair enough, we're going to have some other issues. And I was thinking, maybe I just hit something else. Maybe. Just to give it a little bit of a boop out of orbit. And then this shit happened. Yeah, no fucking idea. Anyway, folks, thank you very much for watching. I really hope tomorrow's video is going to be better. If not, there's going to be a little bit more extra Star Trek, let's just say like that. Okay, so as you can see, I ended up with a mop and bucket in my hands virtually. So yeah, that, that's a pretty good way to end this video because that's how it, the whole week in was. It was just a mop and bucket exercise. Okay, folks, thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.